top 20 things about retirement. These were parts from the internet forums. Some of these may resonate with you if you're retired or wanting to retire. Shout out to longtime subscriber Mike English. He's getting ready to retire. Number 20, you can be yourself. You no longer worry about what others think. 19, no more meetings. 18, now you have unlimited PTO. Number 17, no mandatory computer-based training, no annual goal setting, and no more yearly reviews. 16, you can be around people you choose, not people you're assigned to be with. Number 15, stay in bed if you don't feel well. You ever wake up and just don't feel very good, but you're low on PTO, so you drag yourself into work? Well, now you can lay in bed and recover. 14, if the weather's bad, stay in bed. You ever wake up, icy roads, it's sleeting or snowing, it's freezing cold, or it's pouring raining, and you have to get up and go into the dangerous weather just to get to work? Well, now, Pull the covers back over your head and stay in bed. 13. No one telling you what to do. You are your own boss. You make the rules. Number 12. You never have to worry about getting laid off again or again. Number 11. You can go shopping during the day when everybody's at work. Or you can go late at night where there's no traffic and less people and no more waiting in line. Number 10, once you retire, you can go in your closet and throw out any of those work clothes you don't like wearing. Now you can lounge around in casual clothes. Number nine, health. Now you have time to work out, eat healthy meals at home. Number eight, no alarm clock. Now this is perfect for you night owls. You like to stay up late, you like to play some video games at two or three o'clock in the morning, watch a movie till five or six. Now you don't have to worry about getting up and going to bed. Have you ever stayed up till two or three o'clock in the morning and then you know you're in trouble because, oh, you got to get up? Not anymore. Number seven, hobbies. A lot of people have hobbies that they've always wanted to do. They wanted to play the violin or learn to dance. Now you have all the time in the world to do that. Number six, spending more time with family and friends, reconnecting with lost family and friends. If you've been working a lot, you may have not have time with, for your friends or family, or maybe you can reconnect with some of your lost family once you retire. Number five, no commuting to work, no fighting traffic. For some people, this is a huge one. I know Mike English would have to almost drive an hour a day down the street horrible traffic road and every year get worse and worse. So this might be a big one for some of you. Number four, less stress, pressure. Even if you have a great job with great people, there's always stress of deadlines and problems coming up. Low level stress, stress kills. It's especially hard for people who are introverts or people with anxiety or depression. Number three, no more Sunday blues. No more working for the weekend. Every day is Saturday. Number two, traveling whenever you want. You don't have to worry about trying to figure out if you can take off certain days or how much time you can take off. You can leave when you want and come back when you want. Number one, time. Not looking at the clock, not knowing what day it is. Time is no longer a scarce, precious resource that has to be carefully managed. Time to do what you want, when you want, not feeling rushed. You might feel like a kid in summer when everything was magical and fun. Today is my month anniversary for retirement and I will say it's a dream come true. I'm so very fortunate to be able to retire. My advice, and this is advice I've received from the retirement community, Retire as soon as you possibly can. If you're young, check into a movement called the FIRE movement. It's financially independent and retire early. It's groups of people who talk about ways to invest and to retire as early as possible. Some of these people are retiring at 30 and 40 years old.
because time is something that's finite. One gentleman in a forum said, you can work more hours to make more money to buy more things, but you can never buy more time. There's also a song by Kansas. It's called Dust in the Wind. Beautiful song. One of the lyrics in there says, all the money in the world, not another minute it will buy. And that is so true. Time is one thing that is very precious. And the older you get, the more you'll realize it. I will leave you with a retirement joke. What do you call someone who's happy on Monday? Retired. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below. I would love to hear if you're retired or thinking about retiring, what will be your number one thing that you love about retirement? Take care.